We are under the lights this evening as we get you set for another edition of Baseball on the Show. Coming up, we've got a good matchup in store between the Cincinnati Reds and the Toronto Blue Jays. Into the box now, Nick Senzel. And we are set for baseball here this evening. This is on the ground over to first. And that is through into right field for a single. At the plate, Joey Votto. High in the air out to center field. There to play it is Grichik, and that's the first out. Batting third. The third baseman. Stepping in now, Eugenio Suarez. Suarez left field and carrying well. Guriel back to the track as he takes it for out number two. Batting four. The second baseman. Mike. So now to the plate, Mike Mustakis. And a good fastball swung on and missed for strike three, and the inning is over. Striding into the box, Bo Bichette. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Line toward the gap in left center. And this is going to find the seam as it scoots through on the carpet for extra bases. And he's going to get to second now with nobody out. Bottom second. The second baseman, Kevin Biggio. To the plate now, Kevin Biggio. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and it's one and two. Hey, I love that pitch right there. Better execution after just giving up an extra base hit. Fouled off. Bichette stands at second with no outs. Just inside, not by much. It's two and two. Fastball well outside. You can bet these hitters are taking note of what the guy on the hill is working with. A long at bat like this in the first inning can reveal a lot. Turned on that one and crushed it. Just pulled it a little foul. He's going to be thinking about that pitch all night if he doesn't have a big game right here. Pulled his front shoulder and everything went with it. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. Now this will rattle up against the wall. He pulls into second safely as they jump ahead with a run scoring on the play. Into the box now, Nordis Guriel. And a fastball misses there, ball four. Into the box, Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Oh, they have him looking awfully confused up there right now. It's one and two. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Castellanos a range to his left as he tracks this one down in left center for the first down. In now Travis Shaw lifted in the air to shallow center field. Here comes Senzel a dive but it's off his glove. And a good throw is going to hold that runner at third. So they're loaded now with only one away. At the plate now, Randall Gritcher. Now a big fastball, and he's well behind it with the swing. And he fouls this one off. Fouled away. He got a mistake right there, but missed it. Can't foul that pitch off in a big spot. 0-2 count. Heater caught too much of the zone. And it's fouled away. Here's another 1-2. I don't blame the pitcher one bit for trying to get the chase right there. He's been fouling everything off. He's still got the entire arsenal open to him. So we'll see what pitch he comes with next. Another try at 2-2. Lifted down the line in left. 
And this will wind up a foul ball. Even at two balls and two strikes, here's the pitch. Oh, now a ball hit well out to the alley in right center. And I don't think anyone's going to get to this one. This is going to get down for extra bases. So now to the plate to Oscar Hernandez. Can't keep the weight back, and he falls behind one and two. Working for the punch out and the offering. Struck him out. And now they'll likely need a base hit to get that runner home from third. Standing in now, Derek Fisher. It's one and two. In the dirt and block behind the plate. And a nice job to keep the runners at bay as the count moves to two and two. Fouled off. And that misses, so it's a full count, three and two. He certainly has an open base down there, but you don't want your defender standing flat-footed for much longer. And he strikes him out here, so he's able to stop the bleeding a bit as the side is retired. To the plate now, Nicholas Castellanos. And a changeup swung on and missed for the first down. Into the box, Jesse Winker. The right fielder, number 34. Now a good pitch around the knees, but it doesn't quite catch the bottom of the zone. His past history with Hunjin Ryu, he's one for three. All even now, two and two. Here's the pitch. Full count now, three and two. Freddie Galvis waits on deck. Looked like the cut fastball there, and he got him to swing through it for the second out. Into the box now, Freddie Galvis. A ball and two strikes now. And a great inning here as he gets another punch out and strikes out the side in order. Stepping in now, Reese McGuire. Hit the target, but this is low, two and one. He might still be thrown off from that first inning, guys. He got knocked around pretty good. That can be hard to recover from mentally sometimes. Galvis into shallow left. He gets to it and makes the catch for the first out. Now batter. Number 11. At the plate now, Bo Bichette. Strike two called, and it's even at two. Fastball didn't miss by much, and it's a full count now. Three and two. And he fouls this one off. The next three, two. Smoked on the ground up the middle, and that'll find its way into center field for a one-out hit. No matter. So now to the plate, Kevin Biggio. Line drive to center field. In there, a base hit. Now a long throw to third. And he'll make it to third, and there are runners at the corners with only one out. To the plate now, Nordis Guriel. One and two now as that one's fouled off. Runners are at the corners with one man out. Popped up. Votto over to his right. Two gone. The battle, number 27. At the plate, Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Uh, had him off stride that time, and it's one and two. Runners at the corners, two men out. Slider laid off for a ball. That was a nasty sweeping slider right there. If he was able to just catch the back door a little bit, he would have picked up that backwards K. Three and two now. 
another full count offering on its way. Boy, really making him work now as the seventh pitch of the at bat is also fouled away, so the count will hold steady at three balls and two strikes. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. And that'll get down out there near the wall. And the run will score all the way from first. Now a 5 nothing lead. Tyler Molly enters from the pen the in just the second inning, six. so they'll hope to get some length out of him and have him stay out there for a while. In now, Travis Shaw over at the knees, and that's the second strike. That's the exact spot to lean on as a reliever. As a hitter, you just have to tip your cap and look for the next one. And this one runs in on him as he can't get his arms extended. A great pitch there, and the inning is over. Into the box now, Josh Van Meter. Popped him up. McGuire might try to make a play on it, and no one will track it down. The next 3-2. And he lays off there, ball four. So the leadoff man is on here to begin inning number three. The catcher, Tucker Barnhart. Stepping in now, Tucker Barnhart. And this pitch misses to the Reds catcher. Now two and one. A oh, double play ball to second. Four. The tag gets one. On to first, and they get them both. Now that number 15. Into the box, Nick Senzel. And he looks at ball four now, so he's aboard, and you always have to worry about the threat of the steal when he's on base. To the plate now, Joey Votto. Still hanging with him, another good swing to keep it going. 2-2 Two -two pitch is a fastball high, so it runs full, three and two. Good spot for an RBI. Put the ball in play with the runner in motion. He could score all the way from first. Eighth pitch of the at bat coming up. To first. And as it turns out, the two out walk doesn't come around to haunt him as that ends the inning. At the plate, Rendell Gritchick. Swing and a miss as he pulled the string on him. One and two. Lays off two and two now. Wow, that was a close pitch on one and two. The count's now on two and two, but boy, that one very easily could have been hit high and deep to left field. Looking up is the left fielder still ranging back, and it's gone as they add still another. In now to Oscar Hernandez. Now a curveball's in there. One and two now. And yeah, that one misses badly. It's ball two. Looks like this guy's afraid to throw the ball in the strike zone. Gave up that home run earlier in the inning. Needs to get back to being aggressive. He stays alive. Still two and two. Now here's the pitch. Breaking ball. And he gets him to chase it in the dirt. And he makes the throw to first. Hernandez is retired, and there's okay. one away. The right field. So now to the plate, Derek Fisher. Fisher. And that's into the corner, a foul ball in right. He's ready with the 2-2 pitch. Now a swing and a miss, maybe even a foul tip, but it's held onto behind the plate for out number two. Into the box now, Reese McGuire lifted down the line in left. Left fielder giving chase, but this will land untouched. Looking for the strikeout, here's the one two. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Senzel makes the play, and the side is retired. Standing in now, Eugenio Suarez. Swung on and missed. Really fooled him that time for the first out. Stepping in now, Mike Mustakis. 
by fouled away. The one two is swung on and missed strike three. At the plate now Nicholas Castellanos and it's fouled away. Another full count pitch on its way. Grounder hit hard down the first baseline. But this will get foul, so they'll do it again. Three and two. Well, somebody's sitting off speed right here. Only way he was laid on that heater is he was expecting another changeup. Down the third baseline. Foul. The three, two, one more time. Turned on down the line. But this is foul. Skied into straightaway right. Fisher's under it. He makes the play, and that'll end the inning. Into the box, Bo Bichette. Oh, they have him looking awfully confused up there right now. It's one and two. Man, this guy's been locked in all game long. I don't know where that ugly swing just came from. And he'll step on first for the out. Three unassisted. The batter, number eight. And now, Kevin Biggio. And this ball is crushed deep down the right field line. And that's going to wind up hooking just a bit foul. So a missed opportunity there. Tough curveball that time, but he's able to make a little contact to keep this at bat going. The one and two pitch lifted the other way down the left field line, and that will end up a foul ball. The one two. And he goes against the shift there as this is on the ground to the left side. So now to the plate, Mortis Guriel. And a good eye there as the Jays left fielder is able to move the count in his favor at two and one now. Line toward right center, and that'll get down for a base hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Now batter, number 27. Standing in now, Vladimir Guerrero Jr. And now a fastball, but he's able to hold off on it, and it's two and one now. Nope. And there's ball three on a breaking ball that misses away. Hey, the bullpen needs to step up in this situation. I got to believe the manager was hoping for way more than this. Full count now. Now the payoff pitch home. Sent on the ground out to second. And that's through for a base hit. He'll come home with it. Top of the throw will be well up the line as he scores easily. Up next to the Blue Jays, the first baseman, Travis. Stepping in now, Travis Shaw. And this is taken for a called strike. Oh, that's a tough call. Now one and two. Line drive, and that's a base hit in the center field. Tack on another here as the runner scores from second. It's eight to nothing. Now back, center fielder, Randall. The plate now, Randall Gritcher. This is in the air out to right field. Catch is made here in right, and here comes the runner from third. And he will get in to score, and it's a run batted in on the sacrifice fly. Cody Reed gets the call to pitch here, and he'll try to sort this mess out. He's going to try to at least eat a couple of innings for his guys. Into the box now to Oscar Hernandez. And able to lay off the fastball away here. Two and one now.
a little roller toward the hole. And he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. Into the box, Jesse Winker. The bouncer to the left side, and that's a base hit, so the pressure's on to open up the inning. The throw into second. And he's able to hustle his way up to second as he'll reach here with a two base hit. Number three, shortstop, Freddie Galvis. So now to the plate, Freddie Galvis to two and two now. Hit hard towards center. And that's in there. Base hit. Winker rounds third and is digging for the plate. He will score. And they are now on the board, though still well behind. Now that the designated hitter. Josh. At the plate now, Josh Van Meter fouled off. The next 3-2. Keeps fighting him off. The eighth pitch of the at bat coming up. Had to sit back on the changeup, and he did a good job to get the bat on that one. Don't be shocked if this pitcher tries to go a little bit further outside the zone. Three foul balls in a row. He wants to get a swing and a miss on now this back. next pitch. So we got him looking there. Josh Van Meter goes down for the first out in the fifth inning. Got him. And that's eight strikeouts now for him in the ball now game. Back. Number Stepping 15. in now, Nick Senzel. Line drive to left, and that's in there. Base hit. The first base hit At the plate, Joey Votto lifted in the air to center field. Center fielder on the run, but he can't make the play as it finds the outfield grass. And the runner scores from second as they chip into the deficit here. The third baseman, number seven, Eugenio. In now, Eugenio Suarez. And he fouls this one off. The 2 2 one more time to short. And he'll reach first as they can't make the play on him. The batter number Standing in now, Mike Mustakis tried to crush that ball and now perhaps needs to shorten up with two strikes. Looking to send him packing again. There's a swing and a high deep drive headed for the right field corner, but it bends just foul into the second deck. Ready with the two and two. Three runs already home here. And he's got himself another one as he picks up strikeout number nine here, and the side is retired. Into the box now, Derek Fisher. Into the corner and slicing foul. 3-2 pitch. And that misses ball four now. It's a leadoff walk to get the home half of the fifth underway. Now batter. Number 10. At the plate now, Reese McGuire. And he's a little too high with that one. Two balls and a strike. Here's a big swing and a miss on the fastball. Two and two. Lifted the other way down the left field line. Left fielder giving chase, and he makes the catch in the corner. The batter, number 11. To the plate now, Bo Bichette. And it's two balls and a strike to the Jays' leadoff batter. Speed pitch misses here and he runs it to three and one. Kevin Biggio waits on deck. The three one. 
Now a ball lined to the left side, but foul. He's set. Here's the three and two. On the ground is second base. This could be two. One there. Really, Devato's in time at first, and it's a double play. Side retired. Thomas Pinoli takes over to start the sixth inning on the mound. Number 45. Stepping in now, Nicholas Castellanos. Oh, and they pulled a string on a good changeup there as he swings and misses, and he's set down on strikes for the second time tonight. In now, Jesse Winker. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Winker in front, three balls and a strike. Three runs, six hits, and no errors in the game for Cincinnati thus far. Line to the right side. Leaps high as he makes the catch. Well done. The bat, number three. North Standing in now, Freddie Galvis. Galvis. In the dirt, but swung on and missed. And the throw to first ends the inning. At the plate, Kevin Biggio. Here is a ground ball now for the shortstop to the right of second. And an off-balance throw is in time as he takes one away. Wow. At the plate now, Lourdes Guriel. Guriel. On the ground to the right side. Mostakis has it. A flip from short right gets him, and there are two away. Now that so now to the plate, Vladimir Guerrero Jr. A ball and two strikes. Bases are empty here with two men out. Just hung in there on that one. Fastball here misses low and it's back to even now at two and two. Fouled away. Here now the 2 2. Is looked at and the count moves full. Hey, this guy's a hard guy to put away. He's fouling off some tough pitches. 2 2 count, and he just seems to keep I hanging right in there. And this one misses inside a ball. He walked him, and they've got themselves the a two out base runner. Six. Into the box, Travis Shaw. Here's a little chopper up the middle. He's got it. Throw on to second for the force, and the side is retired. Into the box now, Josh Van Meter. Fastball, and mm, looks like they're pinching him a bit here. It's three and one. Call didn't go his way on two and one, but it's important here on three and one to still make a quality pitch. You have to have the mindset that you're still the one in the driver's seat. Stepping in now, Tucker Barnhart. And this pitch misses to the Reds catcher. Now two and one. Got to believe the pitcher's going to trust his defense right here. Look for something down in his zone to induce a ground ball double play. Two balls and two strikes to the Reds catcher. And he couldn't get on top of it as this has popped up behind shortstop. And Bichette settles under it. There's one away. Now batting. Number 15. Standing in now, Nick Senzel. Well outside with the curveball for a ball. There's Joey Votto as he gets ready in the on-deck circle. Fastball in there, three and two. The count is full, three and two. Now the payoff pitch home. Softly on a line to third. A leaping try, but it's out of his reach and into the outfield. The first baseman, number 19. Joey. At the plate, Joey Votto. Okay. Change up taken for ball three, well below the zone. 
Not a time to fool around right now on a 3-2 count with the middle part of the order coming up. Expect a good pitch to swing at. And this one misses Devato as he'll reach. It's ball four. Now that third base. So Eugenio. now to the plate, Eugenio Suarez hit the other way out toward right field. Fisher's on his horse. And the play is made, but this should be good enough for an RBI as the runner from third tags up. And the run is in to score from third. And now, Mike Mustakis. This is pulled into right. Fisher is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. Lucas Sims gets the call from the pen to take over on the mound and start the home seventh. Lucas Sims. Into the box now, Rendell Gritcher. And this is taken for a cold strike, and he's not in love with that call either. It's one and two now. Tried to hold up there. Appeal down to first, and no swing. It's ball two. The 2-2. Two -two. Doesn't get the zone. Count full now. Yeah, and if you get a guy flailing at a pitch like that, heck, you're going to go out there and throw that same pitch until he proves he can lay off of it. Full count still. The 3 2 one more time. Is a wave and a miss. He struck him out. Now back. At the plate now to Oscar Hernandez. This is line to left. And he'll break through with a solid knock here, his first of the ball game. Now back. The right field. Derek Fisher. Into the box, Derek Fisher. Two balls and a strike. Runners on first with one down. Took something off there, but this is hit well anyway out to deep center. But that'll stay in the park as it's off the wall. And they'll have runners at second and third following the one out double. The battle, number 10. Stepping in now, Reese McGuire. And here's a changeup in there for a called third strike, and that's the second the out of the inning. Number 11. To the plate now, Bo Bichette. Blue Jays shortstop with a one and two count. Boy, I love the way he's competing out there on the mound right now. He's got a chance to rack back-to-back case with two runners in scoring position. He's not giving in at all. Two and two the count. Hit the other way out toward right field. Winker is there, and he puts this one away for the third out. So a great job there of working out a potential trouble. At the plate, Nicholas Castellanos. Hard hit ball to short. Oh, and it eats him up a bit. And the recovery won't be in time as he'll beat the throw to first. The right fielder, number 33. And now, Jesse Winker hits softly down the line at first. But this will be a foul ball as that evens things at two and two. Has a look, now the pitch. Lifted the other way out to left center. There to play it is Gritchick, and that's the first out. The bat, number three, shortstop, Freddie. Into the box now, Freddie Galvis. And he misses two and one. Three balls and a strike to the shortstop of the Reds. I love the approach out on the mound. Everything's down in the zone as it should be, but now you find yourself in a 3-1 count. Do you elevate? And that'll just sneak past his outstretched arm, a base hit. Justin Miller gets the call as he'll pitch with one gun in the top of the eighth. John Van Meter. So now to the plate, Josh Van Meter. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Okay. 
And he misses again. Ball three. Three and one here. You have to make a good pitch on the mound. Grooving one here rarely works in your favor unless the hitter tries to do too much with it. And he misses ball four. So he comes out of the bullpen and immediately walks the first man he faces. Standing in now, Tucker Barnhart. Good swing on a tough pitch, and he'll stick around to see another one. Hey, if you're going to get a swing on a pitch that far in off the plate, pretty much options are wide open. Three and two, full count. Swing and a ball sliced foul into the seats down the left field line. Another full count pitch home. Oh, and he took a big swing at that one as this is driven out to deep left center field. And that is off the wall. As he arrives at second without a play, as two runs come across to now score back. away from the play. At the plate now, Nick Senzel. And he looks at one in there, one and two. Still a ball and two strikes. Six runs, nine hits, and no errors in the game for Cincinnati thus far. Ball two. Good take right there. He's given him a great battle with guys in scoring position. We'll see who's going to win this duel. This one sinks low on a touch outside. It's a full count, three and two. He doubled up on breaking balls there outside. Now might be the time to bust that fastball in. And it's fouled away. Too high, and that cost him ball four. Anthony Bass was called upon to pitch, really needing that double play ball. Bases are loaded here with only one man out. Stepping in now, Joey Votto. And they'll go off speed here as this pitch misses. It's two and one. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Catch is made in medium deep left center. Here comes the runner for the plate. And they'll get a bit closer on the sack fly as they trim the deficit to two now. Philip Urban will come on now and pinch run here. At the plate, Eugenio Suarez. And that pitch misses for ball four. So some intrigue now as the bases are loaded here with two away. Yanked on the ground down the line. But a foul ball. One and two the count now. A ball and two strikes. Hit out towards second. Throw in the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error as the side is retired. Plate now, Kevin Biggio. And that one misses badly. It's ball two. All over that one, but a little out in front. Foul ball. Into the windup. Here comes the 2 2 pitch. And that's low, so a good eye there as he works the count back full. And just when you needed a shutdown inning, a leadoff walk was certainly not on the agenda. He needs a bear down right here. And the throw will indeed take care of him for the first out. Back to the blue day. Into the box now. Lourdes Gurriel. And a good eye there as the Jays left fielder is able to move the count in his favor at two and one now. And he'll just fight this one off as it's chopped foul. Fastball misses in the dirt as he tried to get him to chase the low one. Every base runner in a close game like this really matters, so you can't afford to be giving out free passes this late. And indeed, the throw will finish him off as they get the put out at first, and there are two away now. Into the box, Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Up the middle and off the pitcher's leg. Great support from his infield, though, as that's the third out. Weird way to end the inning.
Ken Giles takes the ball now in inning number nine, looking to close the door. Number 51. Standing in now, Nicholas Castellanos. Very high, two and one. Grounded to third, fielded cleanly. Throw on to first for the out, and that is how the ninth inning gets underway. The right fielder, number 33, Jeff Winker. In now, Jesse Winker. Maybe trying to back him up a bit there with the fastball. Pretty good pitch right there. Fastball in off the plate. One of the things you want to do as a pitcher, try to stand those hitters up. He loses him on ball four. The bat, number three, short job. Ready. So now to the plate, Freddie Galvis. And oh, he definitely broke the plane there as he went after the pitch inside, and it's strike two. He struck him out the third time he's fanned in the game. Now that is designated hitter, Josh. Stepping in now, Josh Van Meter. And this one's up around the eyes, two and one. Lifted down the line in left. And this will wind up a foul ball. The Reds down to their last strike. Fouled off. Has them down to their final strike. Here it comes. And this ball's in the air to left field, and this should do it. Gouillard is there. Makes the catch, and the ball game is over. Hey, it always feels good to win a baseball game, but when you can win one at home in front of your home crowd, all those fans cheering, this is a good win for this team. 9-7, to seven, the final score in this ball game. The Toronto Blue Jays hosted a three-run first to propel them to the win. Hyunjin Ryu pitches well enough to get the W. Anthony DiSclefani was unable to work out of the second inning as he saddled with the loss. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Klesak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com.